So we're gonna do some fun facts. Okay. There are no right or wrong answers. Just okay. your honest opinions to your best abilities. Hot or cold? Cold. Cold. Okay. Burgers or tacos? Both. Both. Okay. <laughs> Favorite pair of shoes of all time? Jordan 13s, retros. Okay. Finish the sentence. If I wasn't Julius Maddox, I'd be. Gwen Stefani. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know why I said that. <laughs> That's just the first thing. <laughs> I don't even know what's going on here. <laughs> okay, so if I wasn't a power lifter, I'd be. Uh, a football player. Let's say that. Okay. I'll be an NFL I football player. I guess I should player. rephrase the question better. Yeah, yeah, it's all good. If you were stuck on an island for a year and you only could listen to three albums, what would they be? We said uh, one of Adele's albums. Um, this is just one of my favorite artists. We got Adele, we got Chris Brown, uh -huh. and we have John Legend. John Legend. Maybe, okay, okay. Chris Brown, John Legend, or Adele? Uh, Adele threw me for a curve. Oh, Adele's real, though. Like, <laughs> So I relate to Adele because of pain. We all go through pain. And, like, you know, Adele was going through a season where she was having, you know, she went through this breakup, you know, and, and she was having writer's block. But, like, that same pain that she went through uh, and, and made, a made a comeback, like, that was it. Like, I've been through that. Like, she was the underdog. Like, she was a... I know it, it manifested in a different way, but, like, she came back with that next album, and it was on fire. Like, um, but again, like, you can't you can't recreate... Like, I like older music. So when you talk about Adele, like, you can't recre recreate that type of vibe that she gives off. Like, Rolling in the Deep, like, you got to think about that, man. Like, that's real, like, ingenuity. Like, that's real deal. That's real music, you know? Yeah. Um, so, I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking about it too deep, but... Uh, no, nah, because I'm a musician, so... Uh, uh, see, so, I mean, like, to an extent... I did I explain that well? Oh, definitely. Okay, good. I, I, I always say music is the universal language. I can go to Africa and play the piano, beat up some bongos or whatever. They don't understand. Yeah. They, they hear my soul through the music. Understand? Wakanda for life! <laughs> If it was real. Yeah, that was just what you, <laughs> you said it be, beating on the bongos. It just made me think of that scene where they're about uh, to <laughs> battle it out. Yeah, yeah, see? If you if you could have any superpowers from uh, Marvel or DC, which one would it Superman, be? Superman, bro. Superman. Superman. Like, I mean, but it has to come with everything. So you also got Shazam. He's kind of like Superman. Shazam, Shazam. But, I've seen Shazam. But, but you, you see, you see, like, when I, whenever you say Superman, Shazam, like, Shazam's like the old Rod L shoes. Like, nobody really cares about them. You get, does that make sense? Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know Rod L. Like, <laughs> kind of like Captain Marvel, nobody really cares about Yeah, know? I mean, I guess, yeah, yeah. I fell asleep on it. <laughs> uh, shout out to your social media and let people know where they can reach you at. Uh, irregular, I R R E G U L A R underscore strength. At, uh, yeah. It's my ad. Oh, Julius Maddox, uh, Facebook, and Julius Maddox YouTube. So just ju regular Julius Maddox. Advice for the, uh, the youngsters that look up to you, or not even youngsters, the people who just inspired by you of all ages. What, uh, what advice you have to them? Uh, when it comes to, like, good things, um, I mean, I was. Because you, you can love anything, and some things that you love can be bad. But anyway, if you love something enough, um, like, pursue it, whether it's uh, anything in life. Um, just because, simply, when you quit something that you love to do, um, it'll haunt you for the rest of your life. You know, so, if it's something positive, I'm not talking about, like, smoking crack. Like, I'm saying, like, you know, you have a, you, you, you have a love for maybe playing football or or lifting weights or basketball, like pursue it with all that you have. Yeah. Like, you know, um, put everything in and understand too, you are who you hang with. So like, you know, we're a makeup of our five closest friends. So just realizing um, the people that you surround yourself have a bigger influence on, on you than, than, you know, potentially anybody else or as far as like your parents or anybody else like family. So just understanding that, like, if you want to be a millionaire, you need to hang out with who? Millionaires. Exactly. Does that make sense? I, I'm like my mind is scatterbrained right now, so like oh, no, I'm not. thinking about food. <laughs> so, <laughs> Me too. <laughs> all right, guys. There you have it. Make sure you follow him on all social media platforms, Facebook, and make sure you subscribe to his YouTube. Yeah, well, it's a big one. This is a rare record holder. That's, I appreciate it. Definitely appreciate it.
All right, guys, we are signing out.